Hi. Hi. I'd be lying if I didn't say. I'm a little surprised to see you. How could I not stop by after all those pitiful messages you left? All right, I was afraid of that. So how was your date? What makes you think I had a date? Sixth sense, all women have it. One look at Bryn and I knew that if you wanted, you would not be spending last night alone. Uh, for the record, I slept in my own bed alone. And I'm really sorry about last night. So am I. Look, Steph, I was married for almost 10 years, and before that I was a somewhat successful musician and I wouldn't really call what I was doing dating. Oh, what was it then? Honestly, mostly just girls that loved the band and they came to see our shows and chose me. I don't have any experience with real, honest-to-goodness dating. Despite your worst efforts, I am completely charmed by you, Jacob Harrington. Well, thank you. I think. Here's where we are. Dating 101, lesson one. I'm going to walk out that door and you're going to let me. No fuss at all. In two days, you'll call me and thank me for forgiving you for your dating faux pas. You'll ask me to dinner, somewhere elegant but intimate, and we'll have a fabulous time. You with me so far? Absolutely. Good. Because exactly 48 hours after that fabulous first date, call me and ask me out on a second date, which by the way, I promise to enjoy, and we're off to the races. You get all that? Yeah, most of it. Good. I'll talk to you in two days. I'll talk to you in two days. Hello? I never was good at following the rules.